Somebody sponsor us. Send us random shit. Morning, guys, or good afternoon. It's actually one o'clock. I'm actually starting this vlog out by going to uh, Advanced Auto Parts. To my window right now, I'm not even gonna roll it down for you guys. It won't roll down. It's been slowing, slowing, slowing ever so shortly, and it's finally given out. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna screw myself over. So I'm gonna run inside here, grab a window regulator, um, and links as well. I might have hit a giant pothole and screwed up. Anyway, I'm gonna run inside here real quick. I'm actually gonna go to my sister's house afterwards where I'm gonna meet Cody and we're going to install the JDM side mirrors as well as some other goodies. So I'm gonna run inside right now and take care of this. Got the window regulator. It's kind of raining. Also, much bigger than I thought it was. I thought it was just gonna be like a little motor or something. Of course, I forgot the end links and had to go back in and get the end links. Cody's garage is currently unusable and it's raining outside so we can't use my backyard. I asked my sister if we could use her house and well, we're going to be using her garage today. This is not regular setup. Turn these lights on. It's pretty late in here. This isn't our usual work environment, but it'll do. And uh, it's actually got some tools and everything like that that we'll need, hopefully. The boo-boo. Great timing. Now get the go. Hey, pal. How's being a loser? So we're gonna do shit today. That stuff. Chris, can you put your window down real quick? Yeah, no, I just gotta, so say if I rolled up to a drive through do you have the um, key? No, I'm pushing the button, you get the sh- uh, uh, oh, 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 okay. Um, Chris, hey, um, excuse me, Sarah, do you have a minute to learn about the good lord? Oh, no, hold on, I need, to, so like, if someone's coming to kill me right now, they're, they're gonna like, put a knife through the window? Hey, like, I'm Oh, fucking, no, no! Um. Um. <laughs> I yeah, feel, you know, I'll feel bad. I'll kill the fucker in the Honda. I'll be back. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to replace this shit box. Oh, now it's dead. All right. Let's replace that. <laughs> the funny part is when I need to have the window up or down to replace it, and Chris just fucked me out of that, so. Sorry, what? You, you just break it. I'll get the window down. <laughs> Bobby! Oh, God. Is this from Dunkin'? Dunkin' Donuts. It's the really shitty Dunkin', Crispy though. runs on Dunkin'. Nope. Oh. Just gotta conveniently put this to the side and not in our shot. Mm. Oh wow, that was so well Is that done. what's gonna stop the Jurassic Park? Now we just need to get to our original window regulator and to do that we're gonna have to take our door panel off and our other old non-working window regulator out. So Cody's going to do that now and he's gonna look at all the garbage I have in my car and judge me because he's a terrible friend. Cody, nice shirt. Shout out to Flitzko. <laughs> You could have just went to New Jersey and picked it up, you understand that? I don't know people like that, Chris. <laughs> Are you using a, a medium pry? Or a large pry? Thanks, Legacy GT Forums. I'm not even sure how many times we've actually resorted to the actual Legacy GT Chris, Forums. Chris, they don't sponsor us. They don't sponsor us. Oh. I'm surprised how many times we've actually referred to the Dunkin' Donuts scrimming <laughs> uh, forums. So we've looked at, we've used the Legacy GT forum for pretty much all of our installs with people that have already done this way in the past. So shout out to everyone on the Legacy GT forums that has already put up pictures and posts helping us how to do this uh, whenever we do installs. So our things are just video formats of what they used to do. If that, I'm just gonna stop. You get that door off, buddy. Hey, what's up, man? I was, I was just saying hi. Yeah. Ooh, Bailey. Oh, God. Oh, wow, that was sexual. Ooh. And so now I'm just tying up some bolts and nuts and bolts and nuts and bolts and, and nuts and bolts and so, nuts and So now I'm gonna tighten all these up. Real quick, I'm gonna lower the window regulator all the way down, then untape this window, which Chris has also been holding like a champ. And champ then we're gonna right whip it in there. These are champ hands. Look at these champ hands. Oh god. Do we can't come and he runs for it. Champ hands. Shout out to my sister for buying everything in bulk. Tell me when you'll need eight pairs of toothpaste. Eight pairs of toothpaste. <laughs> How much? How many pairs of One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alright, it was one off. Uh so it's all good. Testing it, testing it. Testing it, test. Oh, Tested. nice. Thanks for letting us use your garage, Steph. It's my sister. Shout out for shout out. Cody got the window regulator in. Uh, now we're gonna move on to, what do you think? Chris's brand new truck. No, I'm just gonna go throw it out. <laughs> so these are our JDM side mirrors. Oh, I just- uh, Hurrah, dude, it's a side uh, mirror. Nope, nope, uh, can't. Oh, well, hold it up again. Uh, hurrah. You could see a faggot in there. Oh, it's me. Sorry. Never mind. Uh, so, reflect upon it. <laughs> that's our JDM side mirrors. Yes, they're white, but the whole car is getting wrapped. Just assume 
Oh crap. Folding, <laughs> folding button right here. This is like the whole JDM Dude, module wiring and everything that we'll hopefully need. Power folding, those aren't power folding. These are JDM, those aren't JDM, and we're trying to go JDM! Uh, so now we're moving on to our JDM side mirrors. Cody took off this first. Let's see if we can look at him. There he is. Oh, I'm surprised it didn't crack. So now he's taking off that one on the other side because we need to get to the inside of the mirrors. Because in theory, Shut up! these in theory, these mirrors are made for a right-hand drive car from Japan, whereas we don't have a right-hand drive car and the mirrors are slightly different, so we need to make some adjustments. Oh, look at that, it's white. Why does it, why is it white, Cody? Hey guys, just so you, you know, me and Chris had like a 20 to 30 minute argument that these weren't gonna fit, and I kept telling him they're gonna fit, they're gonna fit, they're gonna fit, they're gonna fit, they're gonna fit. He doesn't believe me, but then he'll believe people on the forum. Just, just so you guys know. I'm gonna kill him. Watch, they don't fit. <laughs> they're not gonna fit. Cross, whereas on the JDM one, it has like, it comes midway and it's a little bit more uh, it's skinnier and it's a little bit more uh, angled, I guess we could say. You can see the little difference right there with our light and our stock and our JDM. In theory, this one is off a 2006 uh, Legacy Wagon, uh, but Cody says there's no difference. Neither do all the forums. A little bit of play in the motor of uh, this one, Cody was saying, uh, whereas this one doesn't want to move at all, only like just by using your hand. Uh, that one does want to move a little bit, for example, as to where it shouldn't do anything. Um, so our only issue there might be like in high speed winds or anything like that or or on the folding process it might give a little bit more than it should. Um, but we're just gonna wing it, we're gonna put it on, we're gonna z-wing it, we're gonna put it on. Uh, if it works, it works. If not, we'll wait and get a new motor or something like that. But we're just gonna put it on for the sake of having the JDM goodies on as soon as possible. But currently it's 3.30 exactly. Friday. <laughs> it's Friday. Kill yourself. It's currently 3.30. Uh, shut the fuck up! It's currently 3.30, uh, and actually, we're going to go pick up t-shirts that we finally had printed up. Uh, you guys have been asking them for the longest time, so we actually have some shirts made up. Good friend Corey took care of that for us. So we're actually gonna go pick those up for the APX event that's going on this weekend. I don't know when you guys are gonna see this, it's probably way after that. But we're gonna go pick those shirts up right now across the river, right over across the bridge to Newburgh. Yeah, we're gonna take Cody's car, because currently we don't really have mirrors or door panels. Oh, Cody, I'm sorry. Oh, you're doing okay. That wasn't that bad. American Icon, that's where we're going to get shirts. We just pulled up, we're gonna go, we're gonna leave you guys inside here because we don't know this company. We're gonna leave you guys inside here, we're gonna go inside, grab the shirts, and then come back and check them out for the first time with you guys. We just told you guys we weren't gonna film inside of where we are, but we actually are because we met the lovely and kind- Michelle. Michelle, Michelle here at American Icon Screen Printing and embroidery. Uh, and she's gonna give us a little quick tour of everything where our shirts got printed, or the shirts that you guys are gonna be wearing got printed. Part of their, their shop. That's weird. Is it really? I don't, I don't oh. like that. That's weird. Interesting. And he wears XLs. Our, uh, shop, two automatics. This <laughs> our team, making it happen. Cool. We got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff going on. American Icon. Screen printing and embroidery. Instagram and stuff like that too, the same? Uh, yes it is. Cool, so you guys can check them out. We'll put it like somewhere here on the screen. You wanna go check out the shirts that we had printed up? Yeah. Cool. Hey, Cody. Feel the tiger, it's real. <laughs> so we have, these are our shirts that we just got printed up here. And here's one that you guys wanted with just like the crispy logo on it, kind of. This slap sticker. And this is our first time seeing it too. Ooh, nice. Got the logo on the back. And then it had, you said, uh... Printed neck Oh, oh you printed yeah. neck White ones. Oh, white ones too. We don't discriminate around here, see? <laughs> <laughs> we got the shirts all in, we're gonna go ahead and get them back home and then we'll check them out for you guys, with you guys. So, shout out to, what is this, American Icon? These guys, shout out to them. Shout out to Corey for hooking us up with them as well. Let's get back to the build though. T-shirts. You guys have been asking for shirts for like a super long time and uh, this is more of like a first test run to kind of see how you guys will uh, take these and kind of how they'll do. Kind of a simpler run for the first one. First one is just a black t-shirt with the crispy donut slap on the front you guys have been wanting. Back it says crispy media here. On the tag on the inside, this is a medium. Uh, the mediums say kind of big. It has the Crispy Media logo there on the inside, and then Made in New York, love Crispy. That's me, love That's in black. That one also comes uh, in a white, right here. Same shirt, white, and then the text uh, is black on the The Crispy Media logo right here on the uh, top of the shirt, 
and then on the back it says Christian Media Larger right there. So that shirt comes in not only pink, black, and white. Right media there comes in white and black. A heather gray, which will probably be the one that I'll rock the most uh, right here. With the so these shirts currently are only going to be available at this uh, event that we're going to this weekend, APX Boston. Uh, which by the time you guys see this, these are probably online. If they are, we will link them down there in the video description. We only got a limited number to start because uh, I didn't know how they were going to do, so I didn't want to invest too much in this just yet. But I am confident, so we did get a good amount, fairly good amount, but not too many. So if they do good, we'll order more. We'll make new designs. T-shirt, we'll get long length T-shirts. We'll get crew necks, V-necks. We'll get everything. We'll, we'll do more cool designs and stuff like that other than just the box and my logo. If you guys buy these, if these do good. If they are, I'll put a link in the video description. You guys can go ahead and check them out uh, to my shop down below. If not, uh, go fuck yourself. That too. All right, so we're gonna get back to work real quick. New shirts, check them out. Uh, Cody, that's not how that works. That's not how that works. Mine to the DMs for shirts. Nope. They're free. <laughs> Harambe. Let it go. <laughs> so Cody, yo, uh, popcorners, hook us up, please. We really like them. We're just gonna be. We're gonna turn into a NASCAR team. This was the powerful. If you're a female, slide into the DMs. I'll hook you up with a shirt. No, he won't. Uh, he doesn't have that kind of power. The issue with the power folding mirrors that we were running into isn't an issue anymore because what was happening is with the mirror, it was kind of stuck at like this middle stage in between folded and in between closed. Now at fully open or fully closed, there's much less wobble because there's more tension and, and it's like more taut now. So there's not all that wiggle and playroom that there was before because it was kind of in the middle before. Oh, I'm good. Hold on, I, I also have thrust power ready. One. Try, try again. Oh, I didn't turn. Oh, I didn't turn on. Okay. Okay. So what I did? We have the extra harness that came with the JDM switch box and everything, and there's pins four, 11, 12, and thirteen that we're using. So all I did was I just mocked everything up. I have a constant twelve volt power coming from the battery, going to pin number four, and then down here on pin number eleven. This goes to the brown wire on the JDM mirror side. Uh, pin 12 will go to the gray wire. And then number 13 is just a ground. So all I have is an alligator clip going to a little tab of metal here, nine times out of 10, it's gonna be a ground of some sort. And then just the alligator clamp going to my battery. And Cody is feeding the wires down from the mirror through the door panel and into the car to wire it up to. There's a little switch that's gonna be on the inside that will allow the mirrors to toggle and oh, I was sleeping. What Cody's currently doing is maxing up the, mixing up, matching up the harness right now. Splicing and dicing everything he's gotta do. That makes no sense. Wiring guys tear me apart, but still. Actually, that kind of, kind of makes sense. Thanks, pal. Up in there, mess with the fuses and the relays to whatever buttons that we're putting in no, now. That's right. Hey, it sounded like I knew what I was saying for a second. No one would have known if you didn't correct me. Now some of you guys might be thinking, why are we doing all of this just for like mirrors that could fold in and out? We have the JDM bumpers and side skirts, we have all JDM era that we're gonna put on. We have the JDM side mirrors, we have the JDM center console, we have- Did you say a JDM? Uh, 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 that's fucked up. The parts that we're trying to really incorporate into the car, so taking this like US type shell and everything like that and turning it as much JDM as we can. So we're going the extra mile with these little parts and spending all day just doing these little parts such as power folding mirrors and the switches for those just to try to get it as close to the JDM concept that we have in mind as possible. He literally That's why we're doing it all day, by the way. I mean, it's his fault. You're very. Cody's onto the second window right now. Hey, uh, we are. We're a team here. See, he's he's sometimes just. Okay. I'm doing most of it. It's like a group project where you kind of take a name on the end of it and take like the trophy. I just put my name on the check at the end of the day. Mark, this is our JDM side mirror. Just to give you guys a side by side since sometimes I forget to do those. This is our JDM one, which will power fold by itself. Non power folding one, it's our Cody folding one. Uh, this one's also cracked in the bottom and the LED, or the light in there is all screwed up. Look at that guy flashing away. This guy trying his hardest. He's flashing over there in the corner. JDM, not JDM. New controllers going in. Everything's all wired up at this point. Window foldy button. So he's got everything all hooked up. Oh man, I wish I could park in a parking lot and close my mirrors on my car so no other car would hit it. Cody, don't you wish we could do the same? Not really. No! <laughs> oh, they close. It's like they're waving. 
So this is our old mirror right here. We're not going to be using it anymore. Uh, the other one is somewhere else too. This is also our old controller, which doesn't have the window fold button here. And here are some leftover parts from the JDM package too that came uh, that we're not going to need. Uh, should be should be good. Power folding mirrors. They said it couldn't be done. Actually, we called Fuck the guy. You, Subaru at, guy. We called the guy at Subaru and he said, "No, you can't get those. They don't make those." He Boy, what up? So that's pretty much it. We got the install done, Cody. Spent a good amount of time here getting the install done of these JDM. Stop it with the fire. These JDM side mirrors here, they're on either side power folding. Yes, now we have kind of like a 240. Uh, we have <laughs> white mirrors, black car, silver bumpers, but hey, side skirts, silver side skirts, but hey, it's gonna come together. The cars are gonna be wrapped in one color shortly. Because we have power folding mirrors. How many times are we actually gonna use it? Probably not that often. Probably but we can stunt on them fuckers with manual mirrors. We can stunt on it when we want to. Adds that little extra something and really helps to the overall JDM theme. Thank you guys for watching this video. There were no sponsors of this video, so thank you to Duncan, Windex, Moog, Poland Spring. Power window that we fixed, oh, we did the power window too. We did the power window today too. We did everything today we want to get done. We showed you in the beginning, we showed you the knuckle, we showed you the Moog end links. We couldn't really get to those because we didn't have time. But Cody said he'll probably take care of those tomorrow. So yeah, that's basically it. We are all wrapped up here. We're done, we got everything done that we need to get done, and uh, now we're gonna head home. Got a safety on. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more JDM goodies, go on this car, let us know. If you want me to not smash my windshield, get 10K likes! Do it! 10K! But uh, thank you guys so much. We will catch you all in the next one. Shirts, if they're online, will be down below. You guys can go and pick them up if there's any still available. Hopefully there are. Maybe we sell out this weekend at the Boston event. We're gonna find out. But thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you all in the next one. Push me! Wait! <laughs>